San Bonani Dumelang Khuedach Molweni. Recently, my wife and I went out for dinner, and as we were sitting there, another South African walked past and looked at both of us and said, Cease. Cease because we're a mixed race couple. I'll never forget how that moment made me feel. It made me feel subhuman, it made me feel less than. It made her feel like just by being in a mixed marriage, she'd done something wrong. And today I wanted to speak about the subject of race and know that it's a starting point, not the conclusion of this discussion, for it's something that we carry with us. Race in this country still has social consequences, but equally so, it's got economic consequences. To address this issue, we have to ultimately understand that racism and apartheid legislation had everything to do with a system, not a people. And if we're going to get it right, it's about us building a new system that builds a South Africa that is prosperous, a South Africa that opens up opportunities for more people, that institutions of higher learning must be places where South Africans can come and debate and dialogue and enter into conversations about race. But we have to be willing to be honest about the conversation and look at each other and say, what don't I know about you? And how can we together build a South Africa that together we can head towards that rainbow nation? I still believe in this dream. I still believe in the fact that black, white, Indian, colored South Africans can value the rights of individuals. And for us as the DA, that's the project that we are consumed with. It's about building a party that doesn't speak for one race, that speaks for South Africans, which is the human race. I spend my days learning Afrikaans because in part, I want to learn to speak and connect with other South Africans. I invite white South Africans to also learn African languages because that gives us access to one another. It builds a sense of us as South Africans together. I believe we've got a journey towards Vision 2029 and it begins with us together saying, how do we build a South Africa where the only race ultimately that will matter is the human race?